Hello everybody, this is Samshud Jaya Sion. Uh, today in this video tutorial series, I will show you how to use LibreOffice. This is a great alternative of Microsoft Excel. You can find all of the essential tool that is inside Microsoft Excel. You can also find in here. Okay, And this is a totally free software. You just need to download, go to official website of LibreOffice and download LibreOffice. In terms of Microsoft Excel, it, it takes uh, almost $70 per year. So when you install LibreOffice, search for LibreOffice here. You can find LibreOffice Calc. If you know little bit uh, Microsoft Word or LibreOffice Writer, then it will be helpful. This video tutorial series. Otherwise, I will try to explain everything. Uh, don't worry. Stay with me. Okay. At first, when you open I think you can show a welcome skin, just close it. Otherwise, you can uh, go to the same page as I am here. Here at the beginning, and to show the work page, you can find from LibreOffice, go to view. Here I am working on now standard toolbar. Just make sure you, are, you have selected this standard toolbar. At first, uh, uh, let me let me confess you something that is uh, this a b c all of this you can see those are the columns we are selecting column a column b column c and this is row this is one two three and when i selecting this one box this is called cell you can see when i clicking this this cell you can see this is a b column and row is 4, 4 row. You can see this B4 is showing here. Name box. Okay. You can manage this name by yourself. Okay. When I clicking on the first column, you should see A1. Here it is. Now I am going to change the font size. Just selecting by all. Just click on this corner here. And I want to change this text to Sally B and font size let's make it 14 so you can show properly you can see properly okay and there is a option at the bottom bottom right corner you can zoom out or zoom in okay at first you can write anything here for example name age okay you can write like this at first let me show you how to make a list uh, for example you want to move these two box just select these two you need to select like this and move it to here okay here your cursor will be changed when you go to the uh, corner of your cell you can see the cursor has been changed but when you on the on on middle of your cell you can see this cursor is another okay at first let me make it one and i don't want to list all of them so what we, what i can do when i go to the cell uh, bottom corner here i can see uh, when my cursor will be plus sign just drag and take it to the bottom you can see it is uh, automatically giving you this number okay let me make it let me make it month January uh, once again uh, just move it below November, December. You can see all of the month you can write like this. Let me delete it. We will make it once again. You can change the font color by selecting the font at this A sign. This is the font color. Change the text color to green. Okay. We can change the background color of our cell. You can see our background is white. Uh, but we want to change the background color so let make it yellow okay now you see the background color has been changed 
but we can't see any differences between this three column that means we don't have any borders so what we can do and uh, in here you can find the option borders shift to override just click on this border you can see there is a different option of border you can uh, when you select this one this is left border this is right border you can see little border sign uh, little line on the right side uh, this is here you can see the line on right and left okay we want border around our uh, text just click on this last one here you can see the border has been added okay now let's make it align center we can align right align right okay one thing we are working on all face sheet on you can see just double click on it you can change the sheet name let's make it players info okay you can see the uh, sheet name has been changed we can add another sheet just click on here let's make it players additional info okay you can see we have two sheet we can uh, it's like tab we can uh, switch between these two we are working with our first uh, sheet the select on this january and when your mouse cursor on the plus sign just move it below like this create a cell bigger okay you, you, what we need to do is select uh, select the cell how many cell you want to merge just select and find the option merge uh, where it is you can find the merge option here merge and center cell okay just click on merge and center cell and now when I write something here it will be inside only one cell there will be no different cell you can see this is only one cell just write anything on informations now let's add some player name just click here and enter your name okay now i have entered some name of players from european football club you can, you can see in the e column we are going to create one more cell with uh, name of market value you can see this text is going uh, going out of this cell so what you can do uh, take your cursor to the top you can see the cursor has been changed when you uh, take it to the line okay just double click now okay you can see it's uh, aligned property here you can see in the in this column this this cell is also uh, this text is also going out of the cell so what you can do just right click double click here okay let's add some market value for example now for example we want to add all of the all of the market value make it align center select the cell where we want our output select here and just give a equal sign equal sign and select this one select this one you can see we are selecting e5 e5 mean the column is e5 row 100 and shift plus sign enter plus sign we want to add this two just give a enter 100 and 150 that is 250 you can see the result is correct when you double click on it you can see we are adding e5 and e6 this time okay press enter on let me show you once again we are adding e5 and e6 e5 color is blue and e6 color is uh, red 
in e5 column you can uh, e5 cell you can see the border color is blue and e6 the border color is red this matched okay but uh, we want we want to add all of them okay so we need a function okay in later video i'll show you how to use function but in this video let's add by manually just enter a plus sign add okay you can calculate manually by using calculator or anything you can find the same result as mine okay let me make this cell total okay just merge and center total market value is uh, 1190 okay that's all for this tutorial in next tutorial i will show more on liver office calc just uh, i am welcoming you to watch my next video Okay, that's all for this tutorial. If you like this video, please like, comment and subscribe. Help me to grow my YouTube channel.